thing uh, has uh, proceeded uh, by the book so far. All of the uh, Soyuz systems have operated uh, to perfection. The three crew members in good shape on board reporting uh, uh, mild uh, G-forces as they entered uh, during uh, the plasma region of uh, heat, uh, peak heating around the spacecraft during their descent uh, back to Earth. And again, uh, you're looking at live video from uh, the uh, search and recovery forces at the landing site showing the Soyuz descending under its main parachute. Touchdown scheduled 10 minutes from now. Search and rescue, I am astray one. The, the reading is dropping, is, is continuing to drop. Also, uh, within the last minute or so, uh, the uh, heat shield uh, was jettisoned as planned uh, after the uh, parachute uh, was commanded uh, to deploy. This exposes uh, the base of the Soyuz vehicle and its altimeters uh, to provide uh, information to the onboard computers uh, regarding uh, its altitude, uh, rate of descent, and uh, its range to touchdown. It also exposes the soft landing engines that will be uh, fired uh, just a, a few seconds uh, before uh, impact on the ground. Touchdown now less than nine minutes from now. Search and rescue, I'm astray one. The journey uh, for Anton Shkaplerov, Terry Wirtz, and Samantha Christopheretti that began uh, with their launch on November 24th from the Baikonur Cosmodrome in Kazakhstan is just minutes from concluding. 199 days in space and aboard the International Space Station, 3,184 orbits of the Earth, 84.2 million miles traveled. And uh, you can see one of those helicopters uh, flying uh, in the foreground uh, with the Soyuz behind it. Just a few clouds in the area. Conditions very good. Temperatures in the mid 80s. Search and rescue, And there's uh, the landing site, touchdown seconds from now. And we have touchdown. You can see the reefing of the chute on the horizon. Touchdown at 8.44 a.m. Central Time, 7.44 p.m. at the landing site in Kazakhstan. The Expedition 43 crew, Terry Verts, Anton Shkaplerov, and Samantha Christopheretti are back on Earth.
Once again, uh, touchdown occurring at 8.44 a.m. Central Time, 7.44 p.m. in Kazakhstan. The search and recovery helicopters now will begin to land in sequential fashion. You can see uh, the helicopters uh, now making their way, uh, hovering around in a racetrack pattern around the spacecraft. The first order of business, uh, the initial uh, helicopter uh, will be... Uh, equipped uh, with the uh, personnel that will deploy the inflatable medical tent nearby uh, that uh, the uh, crew members will be brought into after they're extracted from the spacecraft. And uh, once they have an opportunity to be placed in uh, comfortable chairs near their Soyuz vehicle uh, for a quick uh, acclimation back into Earth's gravity. It was a textbook uh, homecoming uh, so far for the Expedition uh, 43 crew and you see on the front board at the Mission Control Center in Korolyov at the Russian Flight Control Room the uh, Cyrillic words, Yest Posatka, the Russian words for they've landed.